brand new video of Hogwarts Legacy Part 6 to this video. If you enjoyed this video, let me know in the comments down below. And if you're new to my channel, don't forget to be subscribed. Hit the like button, let's hit 200 likes. I've been uploading, uh, I've been very busy, so yeah. I hope you guys enjoy it. And let me know in the comments if you want to see more of Hogwarts. And yeah, we left off. So let's go talk to the... Oh, well done with your mandrake. They can be rather difficult to get a grasp of. Let's hit 200 likes. I enjoyed it. Actually, I enjoyed it. I couldn't help but catch your enthusiasm. How kind of you. It seems you're already taking to Herbology like a mandrake to fresh soil. Now, as I mentioned, next we'll be planting Dittany. Let us find you some seeds. I already have some, Professor. Pick them up in Hogsmeade. You visited the Magic Mead. Nice. Wonderful. A prepared student is bound to bloom. I've arranged for you to have your own potting table here in the classroom. Wasn't easy to spare one on such late notice. Plant the seeds there now, and you can return to harvest them later. Even with soil, sunlight, and a bit of magic. Dittany's restorative properties make it a vital ingredient in the Wiganweld potion, as you all should know from Professor Sharp's class. Well done! Once it can be hard, easy. your Dittany will be ready to use in Wiganweld potion. I'll let Professor Sharp tell you about that. Now, what say we branch out? Introduce you to a different sort of flora, the Chinese chomping cabbage. They do bite. Sure him. Hello. Saw you on your way to Hogsmeade the other day. Nice to meet you. I'm Leander. I'll be showing you the Chinese chomping cabbages. Nice work in defense against the dark arts, by the way. Thank Excuse you. me? Your duel with Sebastian. And he's good. <laughs> Thinks he's really good. But you outright slaughtered him. Here we are. Home of the Chinese chomping cabbage. Go on. Now, see that dummy? Just toss the cabbage a little bit. And they'll do the rest. I'm sorry. What do I need to do? Garlic said she wanted you to have a go at tending the cabbages. Give them some time to see your prefilled. Nothing to it, really. Just. Okay. Look at that. They'll try them anything they can get there. But mouths on. Mum planted some in her garden last year to keep the gnomes out. Did save her the deal, but they left her the honking oldest daffodils in ever. tatters. Vicious little bastards, aren't they? My kind of plants. Not like stupid booba tubers and bouncing bulbs. The kind of plants that just have your back in a fight. Uh, not saying you can't go it alone. But, well, imagine that wasn't a dummy. I suppose they could prove useful outside of the greenhouse. Nothing wrong with a bit of backup, even if it is from a cabbage. It's chaos out there. Trolls in Hogsmeade and sus. Are we? Okay. Take your time. I'll see you back in class. Take my time. I'm going ahead. Uh, straight away, bro. Wait, yeah. I need that. <laughs> and with that helpful reminder as to why we should always wear our dragon hide gloves, cool. I shall end our lesson here. Terribly sorry, Mr. Clopton. I tended to the Chinese chomping cabbages, you Professor. Remarkable plants, aren't they? I hope they weren't they too much trouble. Nice. Oh, don't see any bite marks or missing digits. And good, as you do seem to be quite green-fingered. Oh, I'm eager really? to see your skill in the soil continue to blossom. Magical plants have so much to offer. Enjoy checking in with my new students. Sure thing. Show him. Noise. Alright, let's uh, head Until to the next really mission. Only cost me money. Let's check the map. What's this?
Let's go this way. There you go. Next mission. Who is this? Potions is one of the most challenging and hazardous subjects taught at this school. As fifth years, you will be required to reach new heights of both discipline and intellect. Interesting. You will begin this term by brewing a Wigan Weld potion. Mr. Takar, can you tell us why this particular potion might come in handy? Yes, Professor Sharp. The Wigan Weld potion can be used to sterilize and even heal a variety of injuries. It can heal some injuries, nice. but not all. Point for Ravenclaw. Is he drunk? Before today's class is completed, each of you will have yeah, brewed a drunk. Wigan Weld so. potion of <laughs> your own. You never know when you might need it. Please begin. Yeah, he's so wasted. Just now. Use a strong, even motion when crushing your ingredients. Please be meticulous when adding powder to your potions. One errant sneeze could be disastrous. There you go. I'm a natural. Actual natural. I see most of you have not forgotten how to stir. Hmm. Not an easy potion to brew. Well done. And from Did I hear Professor Sharp say that you have permission to go into his office? He did say that. He wants me to get more ingredients to brew another potion. Speaking. Brilliant! You, my friend, have been presented That's with an extraordinary opportunity. You remember me, don't you? Gareth Weasley. Ah, yes. We met in the common room. Listen, anyone with a troll-sized brain can brew an Adurus potion. I'm working on something that's certain to be spectacular. I'm just missing one tiny last ingredient that will add that extra spark. I suspect that's where I come in. You're as clever as I'd hoped. I simply need a single Fooper feather, as you'll already be in Big Sharp's what? office with his permission. Perhaps you could grab it for me. I'll get you the Fwooper Feather, as long as you're certain Sharp won't miss it. I assure you he won't. Fwooper Feathers aren't that valuable. Wait until you see what I'm brewing. Hurry back to me when you have the feather. No, I have a bad feeling about this. Remember, precision is key. What was this? Revelio. Potion stations organized and free of clutter. Talk to him. Here's the Fwopper feather you wanted. Brilliant! Thank you! This is I going to take a moment to brew. You should get back to brewing your Adurus potion, and I'll tell you when this concoction's finished. Alright. Alright. Should you chop the didney or crush it? The wrong answer could result in the unfortunate loss of your eyebrows. There you go. And now we add the Just mallow sweet. That and that. that's odd. What's happening? Wait, it's not supposed to. Ah! Get it! What now, Mr. Weasley? Sorry, Professor. That'll be points from Gryffindor, again. Mr. Weasley did not do this on his own. He 
his accomplice will answer to me as well. I brewed an adult potion as you asked, Professor. I'm surprised you had the time. You seemed rather busy helping Mr. Weasley brew chaos. I'm sorry, Professor. Oh, I was nice. merely trying to help a friend. Taking responsibility for one's actions does go a long way with me. I shall assume that you've learned a lesson. As for the work you did today at your own cauldron, I will say you've done well. I can safe location in which to practice brewing. You cannot leave a hot cauldron simply anywhere. That'll be all. Uh, cool. I think each of us has had enough excitement for one day. Class is dismissed. Is that, is that it? That's it. Cool. Alright, if we look at the map. I think there were doxy eggs as well, but surely those were cold. Three. Uh, watch okay. out! <laughs> it's the troll snare of Hogsmeade. Wait, where's the exit? I need to find the exit. Wait, what's this way? Oh. oh my god, this takes ages to open the doors. So Ah, that's head. Um okay. No. Okay. Let's go down here. Hagrid's heart. Wait, can we actually go inside this? Let's see. <gasps> it's empty. It's literally empty. Nothing in here. What's this? Glasses, great. I just want like a broom. I can fly around easier. I should investigate. Why did he say that for? <laughs> I hope you've recovered from our rather eventful trip. I am well, but I have been worried about you, my friend. I'm all right at the moment. We did not. They want something that Professor Fig and I found at Gringotts just before we came to Hogwarts. In fact, it's why I was late to the sorting ceremony. A port key brought us there after the dragon attacked our carriage. What? There's one more thing. It's a bit odd, if I'm honest. Prof Is that the magic you used fighting the... I think so. I I'm still learning, but I can see traces of it, and I can't... I know that's a lot to absorb. It is. And I will have more questions. I realized something that you displayed such courage fighting that troll. I did, and I Serana did. And wasn't intimidated did. one bit by Rookwood and Harlow. Both... What sort? Men like Rookwood and Harlow are the reason my mother and I left Matibili land. 
Right. I am not going to sit by and watch them destroy my new home. Good. Rockwood and Harlow are a dangerous pair. And the fact that they're working with Ranrock, well... All the more reason they must be that's stopped. That's a bad thing about that. Rumor has it that Theophilus Harlow runs Rookwood's day-to-day -day oh, operations. It's a dragon play. Oh, Taking him gone. down would cripple <laughs> Rookwood's entire enterprise. That may be true, but shouldn't Officer Singer handle someone like Harlow? I spoke with her. She was polite, but perhaps understand. I overheard some of Rookwood's lot talking about a massive poaching operation that Harlow is planning. I was thinking that we could investigate a bit, try to get the evidence that offers... All right, but how? I am going to watch and listen, find out precisely what Harlow... In the meantime, remember, I am here if... What's going on over there? I never thought Ramrock's loyalists would go this far. Oh, this is chaos. It's going to be chaos. They must have come this way. Think! I've no idea who it is you think I might have seen. Who is that? I've been busy with my research. Slytherin. I've time to. Victor Rookwood, don't give a doxy's nip back your time. Oi! Speak of the devil. Mr. Rookwood would like a word with you. A student? You can't be sick. <laughs> Enough out of you. Leave her alone. Stupefy! <laughs> That's what you get. I'll watch the light go out of you. Another death here, though. in such a manner and so close to Hogwarts Alice Hart, are you all right I am thanks in no small part to your excellent defensive skills care to tell me why two Ashwinders were ready to dispatch me to get to you Ashwinders Victor Rookwood's thieves and extortionists his little crow really they want seemed me? quite keen on what the me. hell is that it's a long story but thank you for your help hmm well, you've avoided them for the moment. Priya warned me things were getting dangerous. Best get moving on my research before they return. You're a researcher? Nora Treadwell at your service. Historian and archaeologist nice specializing in Merlin's work and life. Merlin? Of the legend of King Arthur? The very same. Merlin attended Hogwarts, you know, and... Fixtures. These, I believe. I can see why you're so interested in Merlin. I'd be keen to know more about the trials. Of well course. then, I'll let you in on a little secret. No one has yet managed to figure out how they work. But I believe I have just unlocked a crucial clue. I suspect that Mallow Sweet is an important component in getting Very the trials to work. Mallow Sweet. Versatile Mallow Sweet. herb. Merlin what repeatedly that, that mentioned thing? it in his writings. I had just arrived to test my theory when I was so rudely in... You see, each swirl in Merlin's writing has you a symbol it? in the centre. Of of you? That started me thinking, what if... The Mallow Suite is meant to be placed at the centre of the symbols. Precisely. Would you care to do the honours? We can see what comes. I brought a trunk chock full of Mallow Sweet with me. It's just over there by my tent. Hey, well. This trunk? Yes, take plenty, even if you already have some. I have the Mallow Sweet. Lovely. Now, notice the vines on these pillars here, as well as a stone as well on the ground. Oh, yeah? Each trial has these features. Place the Mallow Sweet on the swirl. And we'll see what happens. 
Whoa. Why? Did you see that? The vines disappeared. What should I do now? Hmm, this is uncharted territory. I am curious about these powers. Incendios! Incendio. The fire ah. the pious sink. Is that it? What the hell is this? Today, I can hardly believe it. I take work. it we can call that a success? We can indeed. However, I now have even more questions. How does it work? I must review my notes. I may have missed something. Are all of the trials like this one? <clears throat> hmm? Oh, not precisely. Well, I think each has those telltale vines and the swirl on the ground. You should feel free to solve them as you come across them. I will. My guess is that each. And right. Do be careful out here. Now I've got what I needed. I shall return to the safety of my notes and books. You do that. You do that. Oh wow. Oh. Well. So if that happened. So Nicholas, our house host, oh. is looking for you. We're going back. You can find him near the Great Hall. The Great Hall. Let's fire shop over there then. Um, let's go back to Hogwarts. I'm going to save the Great Hall. What's the great hole? Is it? Oh, it's over here. Just open the door. Oh, this is so cool. Look at this. They've done so well with this game, I swear. Reparo! Incendio! What the hell is this? Huh. Incendio! Oh, let's just carry on. <laughs> I'll be here all day. Off on another adventure, are we? Yes. Bro, this is mad. No way. Is this? Hey, it's me, Gareth. Do you have a moment? No. Uh, you there? Uh, yes, you. I wonder if you might uh, come with me for a moment. Where's this? The Great Hall. <gasps> it's the Great Hall. Mm -hmm. Oh my God. You wanted to see me, sir? Yes, Sir Nicholas de Mimsy Porpington, at your service. Nice to meet you, Sir Nicholas. I know about the book Sir you Nicholas. found and its missing pages. I may be able to help. Follow me, if you will. Wait, how do you know about the book? And that it's missing pages? Word gets around amongst the ghosts. You were spotted with Mr. Sallow in the restricted section. Don't worry. Your secret's Rebellion. safe with me. Thank you. This may be a leap, but I believe I know who ended up with those pages. I'd be happy to take you to him, if you'd be so kind as to perform a small favor for me along the way. And what that is. 
Hmm. A small favor in exchange for getting those pages. Yes, it's nothing really. I'd be grateful if you could simply go into the kitchen and procure a little rotten roast beef. Okay. I beg your pardon. Roast beef. Rotten roast What's beef. What's down here? That is correct. Rotten roast beef. If one floats through it just right, one can almost taste it. Mm. Ugh. Don't mind me. I suppose Eve, Eve, I can like do apple. that. But why Don't mind me? me. It's simple, I'm my young, young yeah. friend. My ghostly form cannot carry it. Now, if you'd be so kind as to collect the roast beef, I shall explain everything else in due course. Revelio. Ah, here we are. Tickle the pear and head on in. Did you say tickle the pear? Yes, in the painting. I'll wait right here. Uh, do try not to get in the way of the house elves. Mm, I'm already imagining the sweet aroma of rotten roast beef. Wow. What the hell? A student never will in the understand kitchen. students. What could they want? Delicious food and found themselves a bit peckish, likely. So you know how hungry growing humans can get. Well, what are we looking for? Revelio. This is chess here. Gloves, nice, nice. Ugh, there's a disgusting smell. I must be getting close. Oh, a student? What a treat! What can Finky get for you? A pumpkin pasty? Perhaps some Welsh rabbit? <laughs> Sounds lovely, but what I really need is this rotten roast beef. Ah! Nick, Finky's a... It was nice to meet you. Thank you for the beef. Peter. Thank, thank you very much. I'm going to leave this here. If you enjoyed this video, I will see you guys in the part seven. Peace out, guys.